Welcome to episode 1306 of the Multipayment Collective. Ah, it's Friday. <laughs> there are not many Fridays where I would uh, I would be close to uh, claiming the arms of defeat. That is, it's been a tough week uh, in that there's just a, a volume of activity happening in our organization and it... Uh, it wears on you. I think uh, it's interesting. I'm talking to several of my peers across the industry, different disciplines within the multifamily industry. Um, just this morning, it's nine o'clock now. Uh, just this morning, let's say seven, right before eight o'clock uh, Eastern time, I was talking on the phone with somebody. And uh, it seems like <laughs> in the last couple of weeks that there's just been a flurry of activity happening in organizations. Uh, from vendor partner side to other property management companies uh, to demands from consumer experience, uh, team member uh, situations and scenarios. And it's just, uh, it just reminded me, I woke up this morning and I start every day with uh, a prayer of gratefulness and Thanksgiving, uh, but it, my mind quickly flooded with the the uh, things that I had to get accomplished myself, uh, both personally and professionally today, and caused me to think I may have to work into the weekend to get myself caught up from last week the flood of activity that is happening. And uh, it just uh, it just reminded me that uh, you can only do one thing at a time. You write down all the things that need to be accomplished, uh, whether by you or through other people. And you write them all down and you just get started. Um, if you need to tear a project apart, break it down into its smaller pieces, component pieces, so that you can uh, engage others to assist in getting larger projects done. And or if there are things that are uh, only accomplished by you, you have to break those things down if they're big. Uh, but the point, the punchline, the action item, the call to action is once you've done that. And once you've prioritized this list of things that need to be accomplished, you just have to start. You can't get overwhelmed. You can't get distracted by procrastination. Uh, that always creeps in. You, you get so overwhelmed by the things that need to be accomplished, really important things that need to get accomplished. But then uh, because you want to feel some hits of dopamine, you start uh, doing things like organizing uh, your kitchen or <laughs> picking up little things here and there that don't need to to be uh, dealt with at the moment or you start to pick off really low hanging fruit that has no real bearing on your business and or your personal life. So my encouragement to you today is if you're feeling overwhelmed, if you're feeling like there is a flurry of activity going on in your organization, sit down, make a list, close the door, close the door first and give yourself an hour to get that stuff down on a list, break it down, prioritize it, and then just get started and have an amazing weekend. We'll talk to you soon.